Hi, I'm Caters, and this is a tutorial on how to freaking install PSU Clementine because you guys are mentally challenged. Actually, you're not, but I'm just a jerk. So anyways, first of all, we need to download a couple things. Setup.exe, setup-1a.bin, setup-1b.bin, setup-2a.bin, PSU Illuminous Offline int.7z, and PSU Illuminous underscore Clementine.exe. The links will be in the description below. That is all you need, nothing else. Make sure the file names are exactly like is in the green box. No parentheses to parentheses, no mudkip edition, no .exe.exe .bananas, exactly like how they are on the screen. If they're not like that, it will not work. Now, hit setup.exe. Hit run if it asks, it might not ask you that. So, oh my god, it's not in English, don't freak out. You know where next would be? Hit it. Hit A to accept. Hit where next would be. This is fine, Z clones are Sega. Hit next. Next again. Uh, sure. Next, 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 next. Until you get to this part. And now we gotta wait. Go take a poop. Go get a drink. Go lick a monkey. I don't know. Installing this part took me about three minutes. Next, it's going to ask you if you want to install DirectX. Even if you already have DirectX, install it again. This is just to prevent potential problems that could happen due to not installing it. This will take you approximately three to four more minutes. After installation has completed, select Finish. And it is going to have this button, so just hit it. It's kind of like Next. Uncheck this button. This says launch the game. We don't want to launch the game yet. We're not done. Now, if you don't care about the patcher being in English, we can go ahead and copy the Clementine EXE over to where you installed it and get started playing. If you do care about the patcher being in English, skip ahead a little bit and we'll go over that in a minute. Now we need to open our downloads folder so that we have both of them open. We're going to straight up drag the PSU Illuminous Clementine.exe over to where we installed the game. And that's it. We're done. We click PSU Illuminous Clementine.exe and start playing the game. It's going to go through its little loading screen. It's going to open up the main Fantasy Star Universe. It's in Japanese. Oh my god. Just hit enter. You don't even need to move. Now under PSU ID, hit enter. Enter whatever you want underscore N. That makes new user ID. Enter your password. Hit enter down to log in, hit enter. Keep hitting enter until you can't go any further. At this point, it should say um, ID created or something like that and restart. Then you do the same login, only without underscore N. So just Bob Dole or whatever. And then you go straight to character creation and you are in the game. However, right now, the server is down, so I can't show you that part. But, maybe someday. Now, we are going to make the connection text in English. That is that PSU Illuminous off int.7z file. Open it. You'll need WinRAR or something of the equivalent. Uh, if you don't understand unzipping files, Google is your friend. This is not the time or place for that. Open it, and you will see patch and patch.bat. Drag those over to the main folder, the exact same place that we put PSU Illuminous Clementine. After that has finished being dragged over, run patch.bat. Now, if you installed this into some place other than C colon slash Sega, I have had issues with patch.bat not working correctly. So if it doesn't work, don't worry about it. You'll just have to get through that little bit of Japanese text in order to access the game. Once it loads, you'll hit enter, and hooray, it are in Englishes now. If you want to play offline, hit up and then story mode. Even though it's grayed out, it will still work. If you want to play the online mode, just hit the normal middle option. For this last part, we are going to turn the uh, options patcher into English. As you can see, it is in Japanese. Why would you want to access this screen, you may ask? This is how you change your resolution and your gamepad buttons. You have to open the PSU Illuminous INI file 
not in this folder. I repeat, not in this folder, and I'm going to say it again, not in this folder. You have to go to the app data folder. If you open the one in this folder, it's going to do no good and you're going to scream at me and I'm not even going to answer you because you didn't understand it is not in this folder. So to get where we do need to go, we're going to go to your name in the top left corner. We are going to go to app data, local, Sega, uh, PSU, and there is one lonely file. This is the one you need to edit. And I repeat, this is the only one that you can edit that will work. The fifth line down says language. Delete the J and put AE. AE means American English. Save. Go back to your main folder, open online.exe, and you will now see that it says in English. I repeat, do not click anything on this screen except for options. Anything but options will not work. The rest of this is pretty self-explanatory. To change your screen size, select the drop-down box and check what your screen size you want to be. To play in the windowed mode, not full screen, check window mode. To message your gamepad settings, click gamepad settings. That is uh, pretty much it. Um, uh, hopefully that helped you at least get a visual representation of how to do what you gotta do since it seems to be a lot of people are having issues figuring that out. Um, anyways, I'm gonna go through some FAQs real quick. They're the same ones that are in the Facebook group. How do I change controls? Open online.exe, hit options, gate pad, and then change it. I just showed you that. Um, some stuff are not in English is. Well, uh, you did something wrong. Go back to this video and follow it again. I can't find language equals J in the PSU Illuminus.ini. Um, you have to open the one in app data, not the one in the main folder, the one in app data. I just went over this like 900 times. When is the server going to be up? Whenever they want it to be up. I can't download the game. I'm using Firefox or Chrome. Well, if you're using Firefox, use Chrome. If you're using Chrome, turn off malware and phishing settings under those three lines, settings, and then scroll down to show advanced settings, and then turn off malware and phishing. But Kate, I are gonna get the viruses now. Um, well, just turn it back on after you're done. Uh, PSU itself is not a virus. Um, uh, basically, people who don't want emulators and stuff to be on the internet pay virus companies to make them seem like a virus, to scare people off. Um, anyways, I don't need to run patch.back to make everything work. No, not unless you want that last part to be in English. Which, I mean, you don't, unless you really want to. Um, what about changing the PSU Illuminus to INI? Nope, you don't need to do that either. Um, it's just if you want the patcher to be English. Um, my antivirus is breaking things, so disable it. It's still not working. Watch the movie again and follow it step by step. If it's still not working, re-download it. Sometimes you'll get a corrupted file. I installed using a disk or an ISO and it's not working. Help. Well, for best results, use the uh, Japanese client setup files in this topic slash video. Some people have had it work using the English disk, but support will be harder unless you just use the files we provide for you. Will controllers work? Yes. Wired controllers will work, either natively or through joy to key Will wireless controllers work with excess use of USB? Yes. Talk to Michael Jordan if you need help with this. Um, what all is in the game right now? Or is it just chatting? According to Kyle Smith, you can create your characters, chat with other players not using simple mail, use the emotions like sit, dance, and wave, party up with other players, uh, use the makeover shop, which gives you access to more hairstyles, adding glasses, that sort of thing. Going to all the lobbies via the teleport universe cubes. 
not including the Japanese or supplemental lobbies. Play the roulette in the casino, the slots do not work, and saving your casino coins also does not work. Um, running a few missions is not working right now because it is crashing, so that's not working. At the current moment, you can turn into other NPCs, however, if you abuse this, they're going to turn it off because it is crashing the server. Just type slash NPC4 and you will turn into a random NPC. Um, how do I create an account? Well, when you log in, um, example, if you want your user ID to be dog123, type dog123 underscore n. This means new account. Enter your password. Enter login. It'll say account creation complete, and then it'll restart. And then and then you want to log in with just dog123, no underscore n, and then your password. And then you should be able to get in fine. Um, I think that is all the FAQs I have for you today. If you liked this video, congratulations. If you didn't, well, I'm sorry. And we will see you in game. Be prepared. I will harass you because that is just how I am. And we'll see you later.